now we have to calculate the current value of fixed asset remember this amount is very important why because on 4.2.3 they said we have to do what a balance sheet which means that this balance is the same balance that we are going to use when we calculate our balance sheet okay mm. let's go to our balances first okay they say it uh, on 28 february 2019 before taking into account all adjustment below then they give us ordinary share capital attaining innings okay the one that we are looking for is fixed assets then they give us what the carrying value once they say it, a current value it means that they already subtracted accumulated depreciation remember is before